Here we are at Chase Field in Phoenix, Arizona, just about set for Friday night baseball on the show. Tonight, the first of this three-game weekend series. Robbie Ray is on the mound for the Diamondbacks. What do we need to know here, HR? Well, Matt, he's been really good. He's got two wins in the last three starts. His team's had an opportunity to be in the game deep and late, and he's walked away, like I said, with two wins. So let's see if he's able to get three wins and four starts after this outing. He's ready. Here's the first offering. A changeup over the inside corner. Harold, this Padres team as they take the field here tonight, they've been in a nice little groove winning three of their last four games. Well, Matt, this is almost like a home game. I mean, it's a very short trip. They travel well. The fan base travels with them. Meanwhile here, this is going to be trouble out there in left center as it ought to be good for extra bases. Goldschmidt rounds third and is digging for the plate. And he's safe. That triple just seems to be par for the course for him of late. Yeah, Matty, he's seen the ball extremely well. There's no doubt about that. You can see here that the body is calm. He keeps his hand back, and he just explodes through the baseball, winding up at third with another RBI under his belt. Now at the plate, Jake Lamb, currently Matty with the third Lamb. best home run third total baseline. on the ball club. Jake Lamb. Here comes the payoff pitch. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Dickerson ranging back. Gone! It's a two-run shot to straightaway left. Number 26 for him on the season, as the Diamondbacks have extended their lead now 5 to nothing. Boy, not the way you'd like to start a game, right? First inning, you come in, you give up two home runs. Digging now in to try it again. Number, number eight. eight. One out and one on here in the inning. Lifted the other way to left center. Heading after it is Dickerson. He's not going to have a play on it, and this might bring home the runner from first. Goldschmidt rounds the corner and is headed home and he can't hang on to the ball here at home plate with that hard double you get a glimpse to see why this guy is a legitimate MVP candidate this season whenever he gets a chance to produce he seems like he takes advantage of it great example there Christian Friedrich enters from the panning thing so they'll hope to get some length out of him and have him stay out there for a while Well hit the other way again. It's into the gap. They're going to extend their lead as the runner scores from second. Make it 9 nothing. Well, Matt, he's homered in this game. Drives in a run right there. This is third. Trying to pick things now up batting. where we left off. Number eight. Number eight. The bats here with a double and a triple on his line in this one. First offering on its way. Swing and a miss way behind the big fastball. Now, I'm sure these infielders know it, but this hitter can burn down the baseline. So if he puts a ground ball in play, the defense is going to have to make a perfect turn to turn two. The 0-1 on its way. And that is through into center field, a base hit. And the runner from third crosses the plate. Throw won't get him. Well, you just keep adding on. That's how you win games, and he's a big part of it right here. That's his third RBI, and they extend the lead in this ballgame. Up next for the Diamondbacks, third baseman, Shake Lamb. Runner goes, and he'll step off. And now he throws on the brakes, but he can't get back to first, and he's nailed for the second out. Big mistake there. Stepping up to the plate, Jesus the Aguilar. He got a hold of one plate. and went yard Jesus in his first Aguilar. appearance in this one. The one-two pitch. This one's flared out toward left. Number eight is there, and he'll put it away to retire the side. So, Ready for another chance? C.J. Land. No hits in two trips to the plate Land. for him in the ballgame. The 0-1 pitch. 
pulled high in the air out to left field. Left fielder giving chase. He can't make the play as it hops over the wall, and that's a break for the defense as it's going to keep the runner from first from scoring. Yeah, it's hard to say what would have happened if this didn't hop over the wall. They might have held the runner at third because there were no out. Digging in and Leading looking for more, back. number eight. And he'll Left complete field, the there. cycle if number he can eight. blast one over the wall here. And he swings through a fastball and doesn't catch up with it. It's 0-1. Now that's a big swing. That's what the big fella's supposed to do. Look to go downtown. Let it all fly. He let the dog out right there. I want to see if he calms it down or does it again on this pitch. Well, what a night for him. He's now 4-4 four for four with that base hit. Jake Lamb standing in now. He's two for three with a home run and a double. Trying to control the running game, Matt. The problem with it, though, it has a tendency to throw your command off because you're worrying about that runner on base. And he misses there for ball four. So runners are at first and second now with nobody out. Second baseman. Digging in once again, Derek Dietrich. He comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. And he takes strike three called on the fastball. One gone. Now Striding in once again, Chris Herman. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. And he misses with it. Ball four. So that'll load the bases. And now he's really going to need to get a ground ball. Ready for a challenge pitch here. You don't have to give in, but you can't be too cute either. Curve ball bounces, and this one gets away. He'll throw home with it, and not in time as the run scores. What a bad time for a while. Now with the plate, number eight. He's number looking eight. for hit number five in this one right here. First pitch of the at-bat. Takes a knee-high fastball. Set to deliver the 0 and 1. And this is on the ground to short. Could be two. The second for one. But they will not get them both as he beats out the back end and drives home the run from third. Looks like double barreled action now in the San Diego bullpen as they get a lefty and a right hander up to throw. Here's the pitch on two and two. On a rope to the second baseman. But the runner is back in time to avoid the double play. A runner on first with two away. Ready to deliver the one and two. Line drive snagged on a short hop. Throw to first will get him easily and the side is retired. Run on two hit. Yeah, and sometimes you just need a guy to go out there and battle. It doesn't have to be pretty all the time, but just good enough to get the job done. Kind of well, this guy, game. he Four was a heck of a lot nine better nine. than that. Going the entire nine innings, I'll saving his bullpen, and Metro getting the win. 15 to 1 Square. is the final. Not a surprise for this time of year. It is burning hot here at Chase Field in Phoenix. Now in the box, number eight. First batting shot for him here, and with the season winding down, he's closing in on a league batting title. First delivery to him on the way. And he takes ball one. These Padres herald as they take the field this afternoon. They come in trying to rebound after a loss that snapped a modest three-game winning streak. Well, Matt, I mean, to me, the big thing is forget yesterday. They got blown out, okay? We all know it. We watched it. And a great job to stick with it as he's able to make the play. Stepping in, number eight. Oh for one here in the number early going. Eight. Here's the first pitch to him. And, oh, that looked like it caught him squarely in the arm. Well, that base hit right there gives him nine-game hitting streak. Digging in for his second at-bat, Derek Dietrich. Two on, two out for him here. Pitch on two and two. Pitch is high. The throw. And it's far too late as he steals second with ease. 
also striding in. Brett now Wallace heading. comes into Third this baseman. at bat 0 for 1 in Brent the ball game. Wallace. High and deep to left. This one's got plenty of distance. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. This is just one of those parks where the ball seems to jump off the bat. Ready once now again, back. number eight. Number He's eight. singled in two trips to the plate thus far. A fastball oh, off the plate away. It's ball one. This is the guy they're going to have to be careful with. He could put three runs on the board in a hurry. So expect them to try to get him to chase something out of the zone if they can. Line towards center field. Jankowski is there, and he has it for the first down. The relay throw, and he is in there. We'll see if moving up. Coming to the plate now, number eight. Number He's working eight. on a one for three thus far. Here's the first pitch to him. That's lifted the other way out to left. Dickerson's under it, makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. Well, maybe a little bit of a problem is they had to wind up going to that bullpen quite a bit. Five pitchers are going to combine to finish this one to get the win. A one-run finish, 4-3, to three, the final, final tally to today. Ruby De La Rosa afternoon. earns his 12th victory, victory in the ball game. Four Edwin Jackson on was only able to work four Dorian. innings as he takes they the loss. 13. Okay, the Diamondbacks have moved back up into the wild card slot. The Marlins apparently have lost two in a row, and we won two in a row, so we're a game ahead of them now. So that's the good news. So, yeah. All right, well, that's going to be it for this episode. If you liked the episode, leave a like. If you have not yet subscribed, please do. Uh, I'm not sure if I got my audio during the actual video, because I noticed after the fact that uh, my mic was not working, it did, or it didn't seem like it was working, so... I, if that's the case, I do apologize. It's, uh, hopefully that's not the case, but I'll check it when I do the editing. So, All right, well, take care, guys. Bye-bye.